the next generation of engineers put their vast knowledge of the EMP industry on display. I'm Rachel Kopchak with SPE TV. Some were quizzed at the Petra Bowl, while others presented at the International Student Paper Contest. At the International Student Paper Contest, presenters from around the world competed on the undergraduate, masters, and PhD levels. The writers of the winning papers focused on topics that are current and impactful. Winning the title means a lot for future leaders of the oil and gas industry. I think uh, this will help me to do a lot of things. For example, I will introduce the SP to my classmate. I think uh, this is really good. Think big, think smart, think SPE. And choosing to showcase the papers at ATCE was a no-brainer. This is a very, very exciting opportunity just to be able to compete at this level and then to be able to get an award. I think it's something that is recognized throughout the petroleum community. So um, it shows when I have that on my resume that it was a sign of hard work and dedication and uh, just being able to have the presentation skills to convey one's research. Congratulations to the top three winners at the PhD level. The winning paper was about field development optimization. I just finished my PhD and uh, it was six years at grad school um, at Stanford. So it was just, just a lot of work, just really long, grueling hours. But, you know, I, I got to graduate, I have an award now, so I feel like it's all been worth it. 16 over NRE. Correct. That is one of 36 university teams who went head-to-head -head in the Petra Bowl tournament. With over 500 possible questions, they were quizzed on their knowledge of SPE and the EMP industry. Nine hours of competition later, one student chapter team came out on top. I am here now with the reigning champions and this year's champions of the Petra Bowl, Colorado School of Mines. Congratulations, guys. You are bringing the title back to your school. <laughs> it's very exciting, and you won once before. This is your third title. That's so right. what does that mean to bring this back to your school? Well, we're very proud to represent Colorado School of Mines. Uh, it's a great school, and um, we all work very hard. We'd like to thank the Petra Bowl committee here. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, the, the co-chairs uh, Satish Kulatu and Tony Fernandez uh, for allowing us to participate and represent Colorado School of Mines. Yeah. We're all very proud. We had a ton of fun and uh, we all got to know each other a lot better. So it was a, it was a great time for us. We want to thank all the other teams who participated. We were all good sports and very, very uh, good competitors. Um, uh, past uh, SPE uh, uh, student alumni chapter members are here. It's really nice to, to do it in front of, uh, in front of the organization. That, and. Uh, you know, we, we enjoy all the support SPE gives us. What is it like really being up there answering all these questions? It is indescribable. It is like you're sitting there and waiting for other team to answer and you're, you're shaking and with the, the buzzer didn't work and it got really, really, really harder. And uh, it's it just, I can't describe it. Yeah. It's adrenaline, lots of adrenaline. So this year there's actually a traveling trophy. So are each of you going to take the trophy home and keep it at your house for yeah. a day, kind of like the Stanley Cup? I get it first. Yeah. You get it first? Yeah. I'll, I'll bring it to Kazakhstan. <laughs> I'm from Kazakhstan. I'm going to bring it back home. I love it. I love it. But it'll be at the school, right? And you'll show it off for I'll real. <laughs> yes. All right. Thank you guys so much. Congratulations again. Enjoy all the success that you have for this year. Again, a big congratulations to the back-to-back -back winners of the Petra Bowl, Colorado School of Mines. All of today's winners and participants are shaping the future of the oil and gas industry. For SPE TV, I'm Rachel Kopchak.